of your ideal mate She looks something like you A symmetrical face and well-proportioned eyes She's an appropriate height With impeccable skin Good emotional state And a precocious smile Are you lads? Right, well, thank you. Are you, you kind of, you're, you're both peering down into the ground. <laughs> oh, we are. Chins up, chins up, chins <laughs> up. There you go. Are you shy? A little I'm bit shy. A little bit shy. Oh, how are who you? Are you? What? Yeah, give who us, are you? Give us a bit of, give us a bit of a background about you. <laughs> um, we're weak of corners. We formed. Um, we met in college. We started writing songs together, and um, just on two acoustic guitars, trying to write songs like Ryan Adams because he was a big influence. <laughs> And then we just kind of got bored of that after a while. So um, I used to play drums like when I was younger. So I started playing drums, and John bought an electric guitar. And then um, just I've been mean, like the last year playing sort of in that format. Toll Free is a song about uh, sort of uh, running out of time, feeling feeling you need to need to find someone before you uh, before you get too old, because uh, that's a that's a constant theme in our in our music. Yeah. Are you worried about that? Um, Not particularly. No, we're, but we're coming we, to terms we, with it. So. <laughs> we think that people will will like to hear about that. Do you feel like you're running out of time? Not really. Well, no. But you just why are you writing about it? Because it's a good question. <laughs> it's a really good question. Use psychologists. But I should. <laughs> you probably should. Uh, I don't know. Is that what that song's about? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I didn't know that. So there you go. So you both. Well, just thought I was saying up the shins. The shins up. Sorry, okay. Sorry. I'm starting to go like that now. But I am the leopard. I am the leopard. She's ripping my clothes. I don't understand her. She makes like a lion, I'm more of a panda, more of a bystander. Down there is a fraction, a fragment of a dream. I'll take my chances plugging out my life support machine. I trade blows with whistleblowers, go to hate the great outdoors, and lock myself away until it's feeding time again. I was on, I can't remember which blog it was, and there's there's comments under the blog, and it was. Uh, <laughs> do you know what I'm gonna say? No. And one of them said, "Yeah, they're really good, really tight, but uh, that drummer loves himself." <laughs> so <laughs> do, so do you, do, would you say that you know you love yourself more than? I love myself as as much as the next. Person. As much as the next person. It's very important to love. Do you love yeah. Do you love each other? Yeah. 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 I love you, him more than I love myself. <laughs> oh, that's I a good thing. Do you love him more than you love yourself? Yep. Yeah, I do. Cool. Yeah. <laughs> um, um, no, but yeah, that 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 comment that really that really hit me hard. Yeah. I spoke about it for like weeks to John. Oh, I didn't know that. So there you go. 
Um, is that it? Sorry. Are you gonna go in? <laughs> what, what are you saying? There's, There's nothing else to say. say. No, you lost to say. <laughs> Lovely. Yeah. Hey.